You know, I decided that three videos in one day just wasn't enough for me. So let's go ahead and play again. And I think we'll go ahead and... Uh, no, not horror. Let's go with fish. He's a pretty well-rounded character. Extra ammo is really useful in every situation. See, we're already at the cap. So, back muscles on fish, really, really good. First few levels should be easy, because I've been playing quite a bit of it lately to record these videos, and also just to have fun. So... Oh man, we don't have anything but bullet weapons. That's kinda, kinda bad, but... I'm getting better at the game, so it's, it's nice. I don't entirely need to get good luck at this point. I say right after the video where I die within the first few minutes. Or potentially before, or uh, in the video where I die every few minutes. Ah, uh, let's see. One more hit is all it takes. Got max bullets again. We just are, are glutton for this ammo right here. Just can't... We just can't get enough room for it. So with any luck, we'll get strong back. Or back muscles pretty soon. More pickups is probably a, just a waste on fish, but... Arguably synergy. Considering he gets more ammo from everything, so his pickups are even better. Now let's see if we can get these sewers without a problem. Now, usually, I'd like to by this point either have preferably something that either can do a lot of damage or scare your face. We have neither of those. And I can already see it hurting us right now. Because we're wasting ammo just shooting at stuff. I mean, uh, bolt weaponry is pretty ammo efficient, and we gain a lot of ammo. Okay, well. Let's just do that again. I accidentally pressed retry, so might as well. What you saw just there was a special frog. Is it a frog? I guess it's a sewer gator or something. That was a that was a souped up version that's rare. And also will murder you pretty easily. Let's see. Uh plutonium hunger, sure. You know what? I'm gonna try. Emphasis on try. Let's see if I can't get us to YV's mansion. Because I I would like something else besides the machine gun. It's good, but I prefer something a little a little snazzy. I don't know, quite what? I can only think of a few things that would be worse. Those in particular would be a golden... Uh, what is it even? Dix launcher. And then maybe the grenade launcher. The grenade launcher is pretty good. I just don't want it on multiple characters, I don't think. Ooh, back muscles. It's really good for us. Go ahead and have an assault rifle with our screwdriver. Normally I'd switch out the screwdriver, 
But since we're planning to try and use it to get to the mansion, gotta keep it. So it's like last time, except this time by choice that we don't have a better weapon. How interesting. Do Got ourselves a laser pistol. And we're high level 3. It would be nice to get level 4, but you can't really complain. Uh, we've gotten good mutations so far. I hope we continue with that, especially for the next level. Especially, especially for the level just after the next level. Clearing out the rats and the bandits. Seeing if we can't get through this as quickly as possible to minimize the chance that I screw up. Alright, well, we didn't get our face blasted in, which is always a nice step. Now, let's see if we can actually get to the car. Okay, that's. That's not the best. Okay, well... That was nearly unavoidable, I would say. So, we're one hit from being killed. Uh, there's the car though. There's the car, there's the car. And, uh, yeah. This is YV's mansion. When it, he has his piles of money, he has his little goons, he's a gun god, so he's immortal, and I assume all his goons are immortal too. And he doesn't really mind us shooing them up because he'll just come back to life. And one of the goons murdered us, but that's that's something that happens. If you get through all that, you can get your golden weapon, it's randomized. So let's see, what golden weapons do we have? We have them on eyes, and plant, and fish, and YV, who starts out with the golden revolver, uh, steroids, and robot, and apparently horror and rogue. Eh, gold machine gun isn't that bad. I would honestly probably want her with her rogue gun though, so let's actually show that off. It's a little better. I think it might actually just be identical to the assault rifle, but I'm not sure. Let's see. Shoots two bullets instead of three. It might do more damage. Wait, does it? It shoots. It shoots two? Jesus. I did not even mean to click that. And also, I'm, I must be having bad eyes, because I swear that it's shooting out three projectiles. But maybe it's just because it's going so fast, who knows. Let's get our canister. One of the bad things about Rogue is that you don't get any radiation canisters, you only get the canister to refill your gun. Or maybe you can potentially get it if you get like an extra chest? I'm not actually sure. Yeah, this is sure fun, isn't it? Now we get this screaming guy. Yeah, so the IDPD stands for the Interdimensional Police Department. And they're on Rogue at the start because she's a rogue agent, as her name might suggest. 
Uh, the reason they get you the other playthroughs is if you go and get a portal, or if you get far enough and close to the nuclear throne, because they're afraid that you might actually start to uh, cause damage to other dimensions. Alright. That's a, that's a nice bit of lore I'm giving all of you. Let's just, let's just ignore the fact that I died. Cause Rogue is a hard character. I tell myself so I feel less bad. Uh, like and subscribe, comment, look at the playlist that I have in the bottom left now. Or I should have in the bottom left at least unless I'm a lazy bastard.